Hey guys, here I have the SparkFun ESP8266 thing board. And in this video, we're gonna show you how to set up the Blink app and get a LED blinking from this board over Wi-Fi. For this simple project, all you will need is a breadboard, a SparkFun ESP thing dev board, an LED, a resistor, and some jumper wires, as well as a cable to connect you to your computer. You will need to download the Blink app, which you can do for iOS or for Android. There's a link in the description to that page. Once you've downloaded it, you will need to log in with an email address that you actually use because you can send your project's authentication tokens to that email. Once you've created a login, you can go to Create New Project. This will open up this page where you can put your project name in. You can choose what board you're going to be using. We are using the ESP8266. This is your authentication token that you'll want to email to yourself, or you can come back and just put this in manually later, and then you'll want to create your project. To add things to this board, you can just click on the board and move things over like this button, which we're gonna use to control the LED. We're gonna assign this LED to digital pin two because that is the one that I have it hooked up here on the ESP board. And I want this to be a switch, not a push button. Two things that you're gonna need for this is the Blink libraries and the ESP8266 board add-on to Arduino. We have both of those in tutorials and links are in the description. Make sure that you've got the ESP8266 thing chosen and it's on serial, 80 megahertz, 1152, and whatever comm you're plugged into. Now I'm going to examples, blink, ESP8266 standalone example. We just need to put in our authentication token that you emailed yourself. The two other things that you have to change are the Wi-Fi name and password that you want the ESP thing to be hooking up to. And now that that's in, you can just upload that straight to your board and we can get things rolling. Now we're back with our ESP thing board that has been programmed and our Blink app. I have named my project the Blink Thing Example and I've actually named the button green LED, which you can do in the menu by clicking on it. Go ahead and turn on the ESP thing. You're gonna have to wait about 30 seconds so that this can hook up to the Wi-Fi internally. Once it's ready to go, that little light will turn off. And now we know that we can press play and it didn't tell us anything, so they're synced up. Right now it says the light's off and now it's on.